On the medical watch tonight, the power of pinball. Medical reporter Dina Baer has more on how the old-fashioned arcade game is helping kids heal. It's the lights, the sounds, and the music. Pinball machines are making a comeback, and now they're making their way into hospitals thanks to a charity dedicated to helping ease the stress of young patients undergoing treatment. There's nothing else that exists while you're playing pinball. Dance Bowler still loves the game he grew up playing. Back when I grew up, it was prominent. It was everywhere. It was in the bowling alleys, pizza huts, um, you know, just all over the place. And now he's making sure the machines are in children's hospitals. It just has a great therapeutic benefit. The idea for Project Pinball, the charity he founded 10 years ago, was born out of personal experience. During a tour of a local hospital, Dan noticed a broken pinball machine off in the corner. He made it his mission to get it back up and running. By us finding that machine in the children's hospital, we were introduced to the power that a machine like this could give to the patients, the siblings, to the families, to the doctors, nurses, child life specialists, administrators. We've seen everybody gathered around this machine. 55 donations and counting. He's still on a roll. Chicago is the first stop on a five city tour to deliver the units free of charge to children's hospitals and Ronald McDonald houses. We know that that kids need more than the medical treatment. We know they need it now in a pandemic more even more so right. It's been really challenging. Jenny Ott is the director of child life and education at Comer Children's Hospital. I've seen kids who have come down in their wheelchairs and we'll see the pinball machine and we'll you know kind of light up and be like okay you know maybe they'll be familiar with it maybe they won't be. For years, it was this Elvis-themed pinball machine that entertained patients at the Southside Hospital. Now, thanks to Project Pinball, it's the Beatles taking a spin in the teen lounge. We know play is the cornerstone of kids' development and their growth, and it's how kids experience the world. And, you know, I think that's the beauty of the, the new pinball machine. You cannot sit on a sofa and play a pinball machine. You have to stand up, get in front of the machine, and it's very physical. It has great real-time hand-eye coordination going on. You might be dealing with some really rough stuff during the day, and just the, the benefit that we know that these machines bring, it just uh, brings joy to my heart. Project Pinball not only purchases the machines, the organization provides lifelong maintenance on each unit. You can learn more about the charity on our website. Back to you.